Good morning, everybody. I was just uh, thinking, you know, I'm always saying it's about belief, you know, because we're saved by faith through His grace. Now, The Matrix, the movie The Matrix, I'm sure everybody's seen that one. Um, now, when Neo is first starting to stand up to that agent fighting him down when he was in the subway and the people you know the other trinity and them they were saying why is he not running and morpheus says that he's starting to believe and so starting to and then so at the end when he's in the uh hallway and the agents down there are shooting at him. And he just kind of didn't even look at it. And he just said no. Put his hand up and stopped all the bullets, you know. And, but uh, now God will protect it. God says he protects us here. So it, <laughs> it's just about belief. It's what you would believe. And if you trust him to save you, here in the physical realm or whatever. It's uh, really his, you know, his will. And, but, you know, he says in end times when there's the plagues and pestilences and that uh, you, you won't get the plagues, you won't get sick. Well, now somebody just that maybe just goes to church on Sundays they don't really, well, not, I mean, I know people that do, but <laughs> just saying that the typical person that just goes to church on Sunday because they think that's all that that's all there is, you know, and that's good enough, but it, uh, well, I got off on a, where was I? Sorry. That's what. That's why I'm not very good at making videos. Is because I'm always trying to think ahead of what I'm talking about, so I forget what I'm talking about. And then, <laughs> but, oh, uh, it was about belief, and uh, so just like in the Old Testament when they had to put the blood over the door frames and on their door jams and stuff, so that the one you know you wouldn't lose your firstborn. The people that didn't do that their firstborn was killed well that's because they listened to him because they believed if they put the blood on their doors that it wouldn't happen to them the people that didn't believe that didn't it's the same thing you either believe the blood of jesus protects you from all that because that's that's the blood on the door frame now except we all are covered with it as a gift so whether you believe that all I can say is, I believe it, and because he's shown me so many different things, but I get how it's easy to not believe when you're not raised around it, especially if you have a lot of friends that are atheists or into the new age stuff, and it, uh, I don't know, this system's so screwed up. But it's all about your uh, it's all about your relationship. That's what he wants from everybody is to have a relationship with everybody. He don't want you to go to church every Sunday because because these churches, the buildings, they're all pagan tradition. You know, the churches the. Catholic Church I remember the ones who killed him and now they have him up on the wall like he's some kind of trophy like a deer head like people mount and hang up on their wall that's the religions he wants a relationship so don't mix don't get that mixed up because that's the important thing that's what the system does is it distracts everybody so much that you, you don't you don't even think about it 
but it's really the only thing that we should think about. So, anyways, ask Jesus into your heart and tell him that you're a sinner and mean it with your heart. When I did it, I was crying, so <laughs> I know I meant it with my heart. So, it worked. Um, anyways, you guys have a good weekend. And if the power gets turned out or something or an EMP goes off or the bubonic plague comes back, don't worry about it. If nobody, if everybody just didn't even pay attention to all that and just focus on God, Jesus, that, uh, Yahushua, You know, if everybody was concentrated on him instead of all the other stuff that goes on, nobody would be having a problem right now at all. But, let you guys go. Take care. See you. Love you. Bye.